thing is, this is not a vacation. We'll be studying this music. Um, we'll be working over there and performing uh, and, and meeting people. And that's, that's what's different about what we could do to go visit Europe. As if you're traveling, you'll, you'll see the sights. But our kids are going to be immersed in that culture and sharing with them. There are 48 students going, and I have vowed that everyone will be a part of this. And contrary to the Carmel stigma, not every one of my students has the money or the families have the money to do this. So I'm starting the process right here, and I, so I would appreciate any consideration you may give. It's, it's $3,700 per student, and we've tried to whittle that cost down as much as possible, but Europe is very, very expensive. So. Uh, between the parent club, things I'm trying to do, we're gonna spend a lot of time fundraising this year. So I appreciate any consideration. Any questions? Lamont, this is a, this isn't like a uh, extracurricular activity. This is an academic Correct. class at Carmel High School. What Correct. Is the William, what does the principal have to say about this? He's thrilled. He wants to go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to go, which is great. Believe me, it'll be nice if, if he's on the trip. I don't have to worry about anything going wrong. Uh, yeah, it's great. And we have some of the top academic students um, and a lot of students this year. The reason I want to go this year is we have an awful lot of seniors. Uh, several of these kids have been with us for three years, and many of them are wanting to go into the performing arts school. So this will be I mean, an education of a lifetime to, to get into the West End and to do, meet all these people. Any, any, sorry. Go ahead. any money received from the township, does it go towards just the students? Just it, to the students. No chaperones, parents? No chaperones. Just the students directly? Completely to the students, and they're all students of Clay Township as well but yeah completely I mean the plan is we will divide everything up um, at the end if I see there are certain needs uh, with certain families and students then whatever other money we've generated we'll we'll figure that out but I, I'm I'm gonna make sure every kid gets to go have somehow you, do you have commitments from these I mean is it I know it's early but uh, right now all the parents have signed up in the last month we've got every student signed up our club has generated some money actually carrying over from this year, they're gonna try and make the first payment. So it's really a gamble. The goal is that no family would have to pay more than $1,500 that will generate the rest. But again, everything's a gamble as to how much we can raise. So you probably are not getting a dime of funding from the school system, are you? Absolutely correct. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is solely our parent club, the ambassador parents and, and, and families that are trying to do this. But competition has been so expensive. I, I'd rather the kids have this kind of an education this year and uh, share a part of our country with and our community with other people. Anything else? Thank you. Thank you so much. I do have a comment for you. You might be interested in this. Sure. If you're going to Euro Disney in Paris, my son worked for Disney, and they sent him over to open the restaurants in Euro Disney in Paris years ago. Oh, and wow. he's not working for Disney anymore, but that was a tremendous experience for him. Oh, I've been there one time with a group at my last school, and it's a, it's a very different place than what we have in Florida. How it's long have you been at Carmel? Oh, my gosh. I'm going into my 15th year. Yeah, 15th year. I started when I was 18. Kidding. <laughs> <laughs> like we all are. Yeah. Anybody else? Hearing none, this concludes our grant requests portion, I suppose. Are there any financial questions from the board regarding township finances? I don't have any. I have none. <clears throat> any board comments? I would like very much to thank all the people that were here tonight, those that spoke and those that were here in support. That's what makes our community great. There's so many wonderful things that are going on. And um, just listening to all the needs in the community and having people step forward, um, we're grateful to be involved in that. And that really is what the Township Board is all about. And that's poor relief and, the, and hitting the needs in the community where they aren't provided. So thank you very much for coming. Well, nothing. But thank well, you all, well especially those of you that stuck around. Appreciate it. Um, we look forward to reviewing all of these over the coming weeks, months, and, um, and hopefully we can help as many people as we can. Any announcements, sir? Yeah, uh, and for you that are still here, um, the budget hearing is in September, and I need to talk to you, you more about this because we're going to move it from August until September because we have a little bit more lead time now. 
with the changes in this, uh, on our budget adoption and stuff. And the board will make the decision on these grants on October the 8th. So you're welcome to come to the meeting, but that's when they will make the decision on each, each. they usually go down, uh, and I'm sure they're gonna do the same thing, they'll go down each, each uh, organization and decide on what they're gonna give. So if you wanna write that down, free, feel free to, and, and you're welcome to come. And also July, our meeting with the city on the joiners, is it July 25th or 26th? I just want to remind 25th, you. 25th, I have. Is it a Thursday? Yes, at 3.30. Okay. Right, Thursday is the 25th at 3.30. At 3.30, okay. I just wanted to remind everybody on that. So that's it. I do think, uh, going back to the chief's comments about the resolution for his accreditation, are you going to try to include that in our, when, when are we going to do that? Are we have a special meeting for that or? Yeah, I'll talk to you uh, once we set a date. I mean, maybe we can get and together. That would be, uh, I mean, that could be an early morning meeting. If it yeah, be. yeah, exactly, okay. exactly. I have a question for you, Doug, about the plaque up by the 146th mm -hmm. Street Bridge. How did that finally turn out? You and I talked about that several times. I talked to the young lady from the county, um, and she had no idea. Of course not. And, and so I told her that she needs to check with all the organizations that had input on that and uh, I because the boards need to get that that credit and I said as far as the the parks Bolt Park Board uh, you know uh, she said that Westfield wasn't going to put theirs on and I said well we need to be consistent whatever we do so anyway I and she said she was gonna be further she was also going to check with Mike Howard to, uh, because with Mike Howard's experience over the years on, on the best way to handle something like this. So uh, I haven't heard any, anything back from them, but uh, I, I'm sure we will once they be, make the decision on how they're going to do it. Okay. The, the, what we're talking about is the Monon Bridge over 146th Street that was funded in cooperation with the county, city of Westfield, and according to them, the city of Carmel. However, that funding came from the Parks Department, which the township funds. And I think and our name was left off the plaque, which isn't and I which was isn't at the big deal the ceremony and guess who saw it So we've been working that out it, It's just uh, it This township government continues to be Questions are worth well, we do a whole lot and it's usually behind the scenes and it's through other avenues um, And that that's where this conversation right. It's not just a monument to us. It's the acknowledgement that the township board was involved and saw the the value of the project and the fact that it needed to go forward and help fund it and that needs to be recognized because that's all of you we represent you and it's your tax dollars doing something that's beneficial any other announcements yeah. I have a motion to adjourn. I move to adjourn I second uh, any discussion no. all those in favor aye we stand adjourned